Yeah, I must be just winning all these die rolls for, for turn one. Okay, so I guess I will play first. We are in round three. This is sufficient. I will keep it. Alright, I guess I'll lead off with a tar pit. So Scoot's been doing pretty good. He's won both of his matches. Have won both of mine. So we'll see what he's got. He's apparently got M10 lands. I will play an island just in case I want to go for the throat. Something like a dark confidant, for instance. Bloodgast, not worth it. Never worth it. Alright. Vivid Crag. Pass. Mm hmm. So I'm going to take two from the Bloodgast. And what does he got? Does he have a 3-drop? I think he must. You know, I think that's worth killing. Alright, I... We'll go ahead and play Dungeon Geists. That's one way to get rid of a uh, Okay, sure. And pass. Kind of assuming he's got a removal spell. He's playing black after all, but we'll see what happens. Hmm, four mana. What could he have for four mana? From the last troll. He's probably got a survival. Oh, yeah, <laughs> I was just gonna say. He's probably got survival of the fittest. That's all the card going around. Ankh of Mishra. It's pretty gross. I'm going to play a land anyway, though. And I will activate Creeping Tar Pit and swing for six. Might just have to power him out here. So, I guess we'll see what he's looking for. Which is, I guess, the nice part about survival. If it's a green card, Shriek Maw figures, and a Mana Crypt. So he pays 5 for Shriek Maw, so he doesn't have to be evoke it. Shriek Maw kills Dungeon Geists. And that happens. Let's go ahead and play Bitter Blossom. You're not the only one that can destroy their own health. Let's play Island. Take two, then fourteen. Damnation. All right. I should be good on land for a bit. Hopefully, he'll lose his flips here. Nope, he won that flip.
he wants his blood gas back, I'll have to drop another land. Thrag Tusk. That's nasty. Could be worse. But he's gaining life, I'm losing life. It's not this is not a good good exchange. If I draw a sword, that would be awesome. But for now let's see. If I pay yeah, I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna go ahead and pay for for Necrotal, kill the Thrag Tusk. He gets a Beast token. That's okay. He's just winning those flips. Lucky, lucky. So I'll go ahead and block with the flying. Let's see where this leads. Destroys my creeping tar pit, fair enough. Kind of figured that was coming. Let's see, let's see what you got. Romp's messenger, okay. Fair enough. Go ahead and attack the two. Alright. Survival. What kind of nasty is he gonna bring out? Worm oh my god. <laughs> Any one other flip. This guy's getting lucky. Beyond all belief. Alright. What I really need is a sword. Of course, I don't draw a sword, because that would be too easy. Whew. I am losing this game pretty bad. Alright, at least he lost that flip. But he's going to gain six more life here, so it's not exactly a loss. Alright, let's take three. Even a sword wouldn't really help me too much right now. It's pretty much got me on the ropes. Disciple of Bolas, that's nasty. Sacks the Worm Coil Engine. Gains X Live, draws six cards. Wow, this is just broken. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and just concede this one. That's that's more than I can than I want to handle. Concede. All right, let's let's sideboard now. <laughs> that was that was disgusting. I don't like that. That was broken. All right. So Necrotel is kind of weak. Still usable though. I think I'm gonna swap him out for Necropotence. And just submit this. And see what happens.